The University of Delaware refused Tuesday to provide the media with an agreement detailing why the university cannot release 2020 presidential candidate Joe Biden's Senate records. As Biden faces increased scrutiny for allegations of sexual assault made against him by Tara Reid, pressure is mounting for the former vice president to unseal documents related to his time in the Senate, during which period Reid alleges that Biden kissed her, touched her, and penetrated her with his fingers without her consent. Spokeswoman Andrea Boyle Tippett told The Washington Post in July 2019. These Senate documents are housed by the University of Delaware Library and cover a wide swath of Biden's political career, but are being kept secret until he retires from public life. According to the Daily Caller News Foundation on Tuesday, Tippett says that the University of Delaware would not share the terms of the agreement between the university and Biden detailing why the Senate records may not be released. Tippett said. The gift agreement signed when the papers were donated is not a public document. The collection of these documents fills 1875 boxes and includes 415 gigabytes of electronic records, according to Washington Post, containing committee reports, drafts of legislation, and correspondence. Tara Reid called on the former vice president to release these Senate documents in an exclusive interview with The Daily Caller. Reid told the media on Tuesday. Joe Biden, I want you to release all the personnel records from 1973 to 2009 and be transparent about your office practices. I would like to hold you accountable for what happened to me, to how your staff protected you and enabled you, bullied me multiple times into silence. According to the New York Times, Reid has said that she made harassment complaints to three Biden staffers, none of whom reportedly took action, and that she filed a written complaint with a Senate Personnel Office in 1993. Reid told the press that she does not have a copy of this complaint, though she has attempted to track it down, and she believes her complaint is included in these records. Reid told Biden on Tuesday through the media news You ended my career. You ended my job after you assaulted me. You claim to be the champion of women's rights, but your public persona does not match your personal actions. She added, I want this brought to light and I want you to admit it in public. I want a public apology for calling me a Russian agent and having other people try to smear my character in order to cover your crimes. Biden has not responded to many requests for comment from the media.